Hundreds of Bulgarians have marched through downtown Sofia, carrying torches and chanting nationalist slogans at a demonstration organized by the far-right Bulgarian National Union. The march was held to honor the memory of Christo Lukov, a World War II general known for his anti-Semitic and pro-Nazi activities. Jewish groups and human rights NGOs held protests against the march, saying that it promoted racism, xenophobia and anti-Semitism. The Lukov March rehabilitates the ideologies of National Socialism and anti-Semitism, ideologies laid to rest long after World War II, which unfortunately are still alive and not only in Bulgaria. The problem is that nobody is really concerned about it. The march, according to organizers, was attended by over 1,000 people. Local Jewish groups say Bulgaria's politicians must stand firm against such shows of intolerance. Bulgarian politicians have to condemn in public the manifestations of neo-Nazism, xenophobia and anti-Semitism. The rest is part of the police's and prosecutor's duty. In my opinion, and not only mine, it's the opinion of all of our management board and members that Bulgarian politicians have not yet learned how to deal with their task. The far-right march has been taking place annually in Sofia since 2004. General Lukov died in 1943, allegedly the victim of an assassination carried out by communist partisans.